everybody, it is your boy Place here, back with another video. I hope you guys are all doing amazing. In this short tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to make admin-only two tools. <laughs> Very simple, nothing too crazy. So, um, going straight into this, uh, everyone just load on to your Roblox Studio, and we're going to look at a few things. Um, first of all, all the links are in the description. Make sure to join the Discord. If you want to run it, you know, I can help you out over there. Um, but basically, you're going to go to the description, and you're going to grab this right here. It's going to be the admin-only tools. And um, you can hit Try in Studio. You can hit Download, whatever is simpler to you. Uh, it's your your preferred, I guess, way of doing things. Um, but yeah, once you're doing that, you're going to head into Studio. And if you did claim it, you could actually just import it right here. Um, if you didn't claim it, uh, you're just going to have to um, go into your models and then import the, the download if you did that. Uh, but yeah, so it comes with a folder. So um, ungrouping wise, you're just going to put this in server script service. You're going to put this in server storage. Um, so I can do that. You can do command uh, U or you can hit uh, ungroup right here by right clicking. Um, Whatever is easier for you. But very simple script. Nothing too crazy. We have the server storage with a tool. Now, if you want to make more tools or you have tools, you just put them in here so you can I can duplicate them, do whatever I need to do. Um, but yeah, so in here, I did a few things. OK, um, there's one. You can do it by doing user IDs and there's two. You can do it by a group rank. Now, if you don't want the group rank, you could actually just delete this. Um, that's up to you. And um, you can just delete this as well. Group rank's kind of nice, though, just if you have a group um, and going off of that, you basically just go to your group right here and you copy the nine number up here. And actually going to the admin user IDs, you actually just go to your profile and also just get this nine number right here. Um, so doing that, so forth, you just gotta put your user ID in here. And then if you wanna make more, you actually just go down here and uh, you hit a comma, just keep going until you wanna, you know, do whatever. Now, when it comes to like specific tools and like having a specific thing for a specific person, um, that's something you're going to have to dive in a little deeper. You can also just throw this script into AI and be like, I want to give certain tools for certain people. Um, but it basically, this script does allow you to, um, check the things now rank. Um, when it goes to this, you're going to want to go to your group role rank and just double check. Is it 240? Is it 250? You know, what is this group role? And is it just higher? So there's a minimum rank. There's no maximum, of course, because when it comes to admin tools, who wouldn't have that? Um, and going into that as well, like if you were to have a security rank and only want security to do that that's where you need to go and um you know just kind of like grab the uh make make new functions and everything for that but um yeah you guys it's honestly very simple and it should work you just change those little ids right here um and and you're done and you can just spawn right in like i said um uh now when it comes to tools i would probably turn off can be dropped just so admins can't drop their tools um but yeah and then that's pretty much it requires handle everything enabled which is good and um i hope you guys did enjoy this little simple tutorial there's more tutorials coming out very soon here and i'll see you in the next video Bye bye